Here we have a manual plastic irrigation system. Plastic water lines are non-conductive, non-locatable. However, the owner of this property actually installed a tracer wire to go with the line. Here's the tracer wire. So we're going to locate this conductively by connecting to the wire, getting a solid ground, and turning the box on. Let's go locate. We can start our locate right at the start of our line because when the buzz box is connected conductively, it doesn't radiate a signal that would confuse the issue. We're getting a nice, clear signal, easy to trace. When we get to this junction box, we're going to see if the line changes direction. I'll start sweeping the receiver from right to left, looking for a clear signal. And I have found one. There may be several lines heading in different directions from here. So I'll come back later and see if I can find others. I've run out of signal, so I suspect that the line has changed directions. I'll start my sweep again, starting where I last had signal, and come around until I detect my signal again. And here it is. We can keep doing this as long as we need to. Locating a gas line is just as easy. Here's a commercial natural gas installation distributing gas to the many tenants in this building. Most underground gas lines are plastic, but installing a tracer wire with the gas line is a standard procedure. To locate and trace the main line is a simple matter of hooking the buzz box up to the tracer wire and a good ground. As is typical, this installation has a ready connection to the ground for electrical service right near it. Make sure you have a clean connection with the cables, scraping through any paint that might be on either of your attachment points. Here's what the setup looks like when it's ready for locating. Since we're in conductive mode, we can start our locate right at the source. Right away, we run out of signal because the line has taken a turn. So we start the sweep to see where we can pick it up again. Here it is, running parallel with the building toward a large main. We're not marking this line because the owner didn't hire us to do this. We're just doing the locate as a demonstration. The great thing about having a vibrating handle is I can continue my locate without having to look down at the screen. And that's exactly why.